I believe in coaches. There are 28,403 hockey coaches in the U.S., but it only takes two to make a difference. Last year, I played on two hockey teams. I played on one team for part of the season and another for the rest. When I switched teams, I wasn't sure how I would like it, but after the first practice, I had no doubt. The two coaches were Emily and Shane. They were new coaches to Barron's, but had some experience. What I didn't know was that I had watched Shane play professional before. He played for the Quad City Storm, which is the team I grew up watching. He was their star player and held multiple records, but never in a million years I would have thought he'd be my coach. From the first practice, I felt a part of the team and built a stronger relationship with both of them. As the season progressed, I realized they are the best coaches I've ever had, but that was just the beginning. Later in the season, Emily, Shin, and my line all went to dinner together. We were going to a hockey game later, but we were going to be late if the bill didn't come soon. So we left Shane and Zoe's mom at Buffalo Wild Wings and started walking towards the rink. On the way to the rink, Emily told us to stay within six feet of her because it was dark and not in the best area. We were halfway there when we remembered what Emily said. We were bored and decided to start running so she would have to run too. When we stopped, she was a couple hundred feet behind us and we had to wait two minutes for her to catch up. Sometime after, Shannon and Zoe's mom caught up and watched the rest of the game with us. Fast forward to today, Emily and Shane are letting Bella, Zoe, and I crash their upcoming wedding. They are both still Bella and my coaches and will be for the next few years. They are part of the reason my passion for hockey has grown so much. They are the reason I want to go to practice. They are the reason I still play hockey. Emily and Shane are the reason I believe in coaches.